know there are a lot of people on the stage and in the audience who are small business owners and maybe want to become small business owners. And we have this incredible panel and I wanted to open it up for each of you to talk to that person, give them your best advice, inspire them, let them know what you think, what you've learned along the way in terms of how to scale up a business, how to really make it grow. A little encouragement is always, always good as well. And Mr. Buffett, we'll start with you. Well, tomorrow morning, uh, when you look in the mirror after you've gotten up, just write, put it in lipstick or whatever you want on the mirror and just put, delight my customer. Not satisfy my customer, delight my customer. Uh, the, any business that has delighted customers has a sales force out there that you don't have to pay, you don't see them, but they're talking to people all the time. I, whenever I bought my last car a few years ago, I don't remember how much I paid, but I remember the experience I had. I either went out of there feeling very good about the person that dealt with me, or I, I felt, you know, next time I'm gonna go someplace else. So your customer is going to get to vote, they're gonna get to talk, and you want them out there as salesmen for you, and they will be if you delight them. Uh, the classic example, Jeff Bezos. I mean, here's a fellow that 20 years ago had a very, very, very small business. But he set out every day to delight his customer by, by a fast delivery, by, uh, by lower prices, whatever it took. And today, he is thinking about how to further delight his customer. He'll never quit. And you, you will succeed if you have delighted customers. So don't settle for satisfied. Have that person walk out the door thinking, I've never had a better experience with a human being. And they'll be back to buy your product. 